Welcome to Dava's Bed and Breakfast in Randers. Um, £80 a night. They do a lovely breakfast in the morning. It's got everything. You know, it's got a wardrobe. It's got a widescreen TV that folds right into the wall. Um, we've got a mirror and a large desk with, with lamp that lights one side of it. It's, it's the perfect spot while I go house hunting. Right, today we're going to get straight into it. It's a perfect episode it's going to be a little bit long probably because we're going to do three games because it's like a perfect set of three games to see where we're at we've got a home game against a mid-table side perfect winnable game we've got a tricky away leg against porto in the europa league and then we're playing our arch rivals away from home and they're six in the league so a very good test so depending on how this episode goes we'll dictate the rest of our season Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back. So, as I said, three games. We have yet to make the uh, Dodds signing. He's, he's still deciding. Oh, the others have dropped out. Okay, so we should get him. Um, and I think from the rules, we can register him at any time. Now, last game was kind of a... It's kind of always pre-season because they're a non-league side, right? So, this is the test. I'm going to use the same team, same tactic. We've got plenty of games coming up, so we're going to have to rest a few players... But this is... <laughs> I'm, I'm so worried we just get beaten 4-0 and the whole plan capitulates immediately. Uh, Lingbia sitting in ninth, I think it is. Oh, God. Send assistant. Oh, I need to fix that. Okay. Here we go, everybody. Good luck. Sicko up top. Ken could be an important player, I think. I think Ken's going to be our key man, if I had to guess. Okay. Let's get the old league table up so we can... Have a watch. So we need to gain eight points in this last, if at all possible, in these last few games. We would need to pretty much win most of them. All right. Chukwani. All right. The names are going to be fun. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. So we're playing a counter-attacking football, so I expect less possession. Uh... So I'm not expecting less possession, but I want some speedy counter-attacks. We lull them onto us. We've got a lower defensive line. We win the ball back and spring the trap. That's how that's how it's supposed to work in my head. Okay, decent tackle, but they've got it back. Deflected shot. Tonks probably didn't need to make the save, but he's got to make sure. He's got to make sure. Right. And we've got men up on the defensive corners, so we can hopefully have the odd counter-attack. Okay. It all looks pretty expected, Frederick. Heavy touch. But there's Ken. There's Ken. What's he got? Come on, Ken. Oh, it's almost an own goal. Clears it off the line. We'll take any sort of goals. Right, here's This smells like counter-attack. Win that. Win the second ball. Win the third ball. Win the fourth ball. Win a ball. Yes, there we go. Now, counter. I don't think we're going to counter that hard because Sicko, the striker, was the one that won the header there. <laughs> For some reason. <laughs> okay, that's fine. That's a great ball. All right, it's all right. It's okay. It's okay. They've not had any big chances yet. Let off a couple of flares. The stadium looks actually randomly. The stadium looks kind of realistic to the actual stadium, which might be a football manager first. It's two tiers. It looks a bit big. Sorry, it's fine. It's a long range shot. We don't mind him having having shots just because that one looked close. Don't worry about it. I would like to have a shot on target, though, if we can. It's okay. Right, here we go. Delgado. Another one of our key men. Oh, he does him. <laughs> he absolutely sold that guy down the river. That's a great ball. Go on, Ken. Go on, Ken. Oh, it's a save. 
That's a massive chance. We're not going to create a ton, so we have to take those chances. I don't know where that player, but he went off. He was off to catch a bus or something. Come on, Thanos! Let's go! Set piece, boys. Got me a stoke cap on and everything. Oh, it's like a back header as well. Okay. We need to win the second. Like second balls, it seems to be. We're not winning any of those. AGF are losing 3 0. Which I guess is good for us. This is kind of how it, exactly how I expected and kind of wanted this to go. Now, our backups aren't great. Like he's fine as a striker. We could put Ken up top. He's a better striker than he is, but do we... Um, is he right? They're all bloody left-footed, aren't they? How are they all left? How have I ended up with a load of lefties? Mads is a lefty, but I think he, he has a right foot. Okay. And then we'll go... However, that... <sighs> Carl. Carl. I was going to say, I don't know how we're going to even try and pronounce that one. That could be anything. Carl. Um, and we'll make you just a winger. Okay, Ken, see what you got up top, mate. Um, we kind of need to bring. Ha uh, this doesn't really work. Like right, Chernak, do you have it? It doesn't say left only, so he's a perfectionist, which is quite nice. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. Okay. Um, defensively, I've had a word with Gomez because he should be our best defender and he's not been playing well recently before we joined. So I've had a word. I've let him know. Um, I kind of don't want to change too much because I don't really know the players well enough to trust anyone. Okay. Storm. Is he like a gladiator reject? Oh, Tonks gets fingertips to it. I thought that was going in the corner. Could bring the youngster on that can't do anything. Ribeiro's offside. Come on, boys. Come on, win the ball back and we go. Nice and compact. I'm liking the shape. I don't know how we're beaten with that ball. He's offside, but I, we shouldn't. We've got a lowered line. We shouldn't be. Able to, they shouldn't be able to just whip a ball in behind from from over there that easily. Because it wasn't a mile offside. Okay, I think we're just going to just don't look at him. We'll pretend he's a proper striker. Um, and then a bird master. Um, we don't really have a left back. It's Kenneth. I'll bring you on, but we'll just make you a devoted fullback defender at this point. We'll commit to the bit. Time wasting last 10 minutes. See you out, lads. See it out. Come on. Oh, no. That doesn't look like a flare, by the way, in the crowd. That just looks like something's on fire. Oh, my God. How? Oh, my God. Tonks, you've just got to catch that. Fire. Come on. Oh, no. Is this the first... Oh, God. I was going to say, is that the first highlight that started with us with the ball? Oh, it tries to... Push him off the ball. We've got two back there. Yes, Gomez. Okay, Jakobsen. Arm. You've ran into each other, lads. You've just ran into each other. No, mm. oh, tits on a stick. Oh, my God. My two players ran into each other and lost the ball that led to that goal. The game's so embarrassed it didn't show it. It, 
I, it would have been a perfect kind of result before, you know, that, that bit at the end. Load, much less possession, but a couple of really good chances. We looked dangerous on the counter. They were having a few long pops, and then that happens at the end. Okay, but overall, I would say that's not negative. That's okay. That is, there's a bare minimum, just about okay. Now, this one, we're playing the Sporting Lisbon away, so it's, this could be tricky. So, Sporting, slight trouble. Um, Kenneth Jensen's taken a knock. He's out for a little bit, and we are really low on defenders. Pellegrini's our only defender left, which is a slight problem. We do have a youngster that's okay, <clears throat> Martin Yule, but he's not registered to play in Europe. But he, he, like, if I have to use him, I have to use him at some point. Um, but okay, well, I'm not going to, I'm not changing, regardless of how things go in these three games, I'm not changing anything tactically. I'm going to just go, right, see how you do. Gomez also wants a rest, but we just can't, so tuck it up. Um, I don't think we're going to make the, how many points? We're only two points currently off the, uh, playoffy, playoffy bit. How many have we got left? Four, five Europa League games? It's doable. Look, who have we got? Andelect, Mold, and Derry. Derry, Derry's definitely been here. <laughs> it's so hard to know where we are. I think this we're big outsiders here. Thanos doesn't like doesn't like something. Okay, yeah, been on a good run. <clears throat> oh, forgot. Got Europa League music. Okay, oh, you missed it. I'm sorry. Right. Little upset, boys. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Oh, oh, hello. Keep it in your pants, boys. Save it for after. Save it for the celebrations. Yeah, he's rolling up his socks. Umbop. Right, decent effort. Adds to the shot. Looks like we're dominating. Okay. This is, this is going weirdly, weirdly well so far. Okay, Thanos, or oh, that pace. Okay, Gomez. This is nice. Ken. Oh, Ken. Okay, Horns takes over. Lovely, lovely. Oh, hello. Some good football there. Okay, good. We like it. Solid so far, boys. What's that name? Eggs. Just call him Eggs. Oh, what is that name? Sheldrop. Okay, Sheldrop ish. Tonks. There you go. I was looking at Tonks. He's he's not great, but aerially he is very, very good. That's it. The rest is except just about acceptable, but definitely somewhere we need to upgrade in the summer. Although, annoyingly, we are actually signing him already. Okay. Jimmy J. <laughs> Jimmy J. Morgan. Okay. Where's he from? Where's he from? I'm going to... Ireland. Oh, he's English. Is he a bit Irish? Oh, he's born him just up the road from me. Okay. This this still isn't a negative performance so far. We do need like a backup option for when we're actually chasing games and we need to go for it a bit. But I don't immediately want to revert to my standard press high press to get back into the game. So I think maybe we just go more direct. Although we don't have the target men for this. That's what another thing we need. We need somebody up top. One of the three attacking positions that's just a big boy. Maybe even a wide target man. It's the dream. Okay. Getting played around a little bit here. But this is fine. This is what we do. Keep it solid, boys. This is all right. This is all right. 
it's not. I feel like the highlight could have started another 30 seconds after this, but okay. <clears throat> That's happened too many times already, that ball in behind. That should be one of the things we're good at dealing with. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to say that was all right. Well, we've got a kickoff highlight. I know we have to, we're counter-attacking, but that, that doesn't mean we have to just give the ball to them so they can have an attack so we can counter. We are also allowed to just have an attack. Okay, Mbele, apparently he's their best player. I got warned about him. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, can we do an attack? Nice. Okay. Lovely, lovely. Where's the runs? This is nice. Go on, go on, go on, go on. Yes! Sicko! Pounces on the error. All right. All right. Instant hit make. So this is... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, quite a difference between the teams. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm fine with this performance. I think it's okay against a way better team, which is probably better for this tactic overall. Sicko's not even looking at the ball, but okay. Oh, he's done him there. Good block. I don't think this is terrible. It's, it's the rival game next that's the big one, though. Considering we don't really have, like, enough players for this currently. Can you play centre-back? You can jump. I need to rest Gomez like he's going to die. But it doesn't matter too much. We're good, probably going to lose this game as it is. Right, okay. So let's get like 75 minutes and then work out what we do. Okay. All right, Mbele. Let's get to 70 minutes. Okay. It's not looking quite as good now. We get another one. Oh no. Oh no, we're the ones being countered. No, this is not how it's supposed to work. Bring him down! Bring him down! Yeah, here we go. Counter. We've countered the counter. Frederick. Not the quickest boy, is he? He's having a little wander all over the place. Nice. Cut it back. Hit it. Oh. That should have been a goal. Oh, they've countered the counter, the counter. Oh, come on. This can't be their goal. Good tackle. Oh, we've countered the counter, the counter, the counter. Here we go again. <laughs> it's unheard of. It's never been done. Sicko. Oh. <laughs> okay, so let's pretend this is a league game that we have a chance of winning. Rather than just going... I think we can add a bit more width. <clears throat> I don't want to just go like a punt it long. Um, see, my default is just to, just to. I think I suppose we could still keep the low block, but s still trigger the press more often. So as soon as they get in, essentially into our half, we smush them. Um, I don't like. Because Sicko's, Sicko's, no, he's, he's not aerially any good. And can you defend? No, Hucky. I think we definitely sell this guy. He could be a fundraiser for the spending, I think. Because in the few games I've played so far, even when I need a sub, I'm like, 
<laughs> That's, do I bring him on as a just striker? Right. Here we go. He's had a pub. He doesn't mind. He's just he's having a little dig at it. He's trying to make an impact. I I think this is acceptable. Oh dear, that was a shocking clearance there. And he's been done. I love the flares just look like something's on fire. We've created a ton of chances. Go on. We've also conceded a ton of chances. But that's the expected. The expected part is that we conceded a ton of chances against Sporting, right? The unexpected part is that we created a lot of chances with 27% possession. I'm trying to train my brain, okay, guys? I'm not very good at this sort of tactic. And it, it hurts my brain when most highlights start with them having the ball and hopefully we get it back or something. Okay. What a game. Absolutely fuming. Should, no, surely you should be happy that we created enough, you know? I, I think that's acceptable. Right. Thing is with this one, because it's our arch rivals and we're supposed to finish above them in the league, a, a good performance isn't except like a bad performance and a win is kind of what we need. Like just anything, the result that all is all that matters now. So, good news, bad news. Slight mistakes were made. Uh, forgot to rest the players um, until just just then. Like have a, have a ten minute rest before the game, guys. Um, so ugh, tricky in the battle for East Jutland. Um, <laughs> At least Kenneth is back, so he can go on the bench. And the good news, uh, we've got a 400k bid. Like, this guy's not bad. He's all physicals, though. But for 400 grand, do we get all of that money? We get 52% of it. That's fine. 200 grand, that gives me some sort of wiggle room to bring in a defender. Ideally, a left-footed centre-back that can also play left-back. Might be too much to ask. But a left-footed centre-back is a must. A no nonsense, just get the job done type of fella is uh, key to this. Um, all right, what do we do? Okay, we can have. What role is it? What role is the right hand side? <coughs> okay, we can have Ross suffer the right hand side. The other guys, I think we just play, give them a half and see how they do. We don't really have much of a replacement. At least Kenneth's back now. I might give him... You know what? Gomez's been awful. I'll give Kenneth a game. Um, and then we'll save Pellegrini to come on in one of the other roles if it, tiredness. Okay. Oh, so, so we need a kind of result here, boys. It's, it's all right playing... Some interesting football and the, the tactics are kind of working. Might need some tweaking, but I, I like, as I've always said, especially if you're not the great at tactics like me, make a tactic, but give it a few games. Players take a bit to learn it and you'll just get a better idea. You won't, you know, because there's lots of one-off things that can happen in a game that don't necessarily mean your tactic is gone. Oh, sicko, just keep it down. Slot it in the corner. Oh, that's an absolute sitter. But yeah, there's enough so far in this tactic that I think we we can make this work. <clears throat> Especially because there's such obvious holes in this team. Like the goalkeeper's not very good. Need another centre back. Need another right footed winger. I'm still the jury's out on the uh, advanced playmaker on the left hand side. I kind of want to use a wide target man. I'm going to find a wide target man. Probably use them on the right. Oh no, because Ken's good though. But Ken can play up front. Yeah, okay, okay. Wide target man on the right. And a left winger. Good save, Tonks! Come on, we need a result, boys. Come on, come on. chances good possession is there such, there must be such a thing as too little possession in this sort of tactic right if you're like that 15% I feel like you need to 
maybe get hold of the ball a little bit. I think 30% is fine. Right, here we go. Counter attack. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Good win. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's awful. I'm not seeing... I'm not seeing many counter attacks is what so far that I'm noting. We had last game where there was a counter, 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 counter attack, which is fair. Okay, we're just being outplayed. They are better than us, but we're just being outplayed here. Um, what... Let's put you on attack. I'm going to play some wide football. Okay, so Pellegrini's going to come on as the anchor. He's also a backup right back. Frederick can play right back. Defensively not amazing, but Bax is getting poor. Okay. Find them up. Come on, boys. This might be the most disappointing one so far. I'm struggling to find ways of going more attacking when I'm 1-0 down, but by trying to keep the same style without just reverting to a high press. Feel free to leave a comment um, with changes. This, like, I don't want to just go long, because the problem is we don't have anybody... Oh, Ken's injured. We don't have anybody that's any sort of size up front. The trouble is, our, we don't have the right players on the bench to fit the tactic, so we can't just like, ah, like for like. I like, can use this tactic and go attack. I guess you can. Go on, go on. Frederick. There we go. Done him. He's done. Oh, penalty all day long. Get him off, ref. Get him off. I think you tried to rip a nipple off there. Okay, who takes penalties? God knows. No idea. Sicko. Just go for the gamble of the number nine being the best penalty taker. Is he? Is he? It's Diego Rossa. Oh my fuck my life. Pinpoint accuracy to the guy's hands. He aimed for the centre of the goalkeeper's gloves. That's one of the worst penalties I've ever seen. It's not, he's not even pinged it low to try and get it under the goalkeeper or like pinged it high into the roof of the net. It's as middle of the middle as you could possibly do. What's his penalty take? He's got 12 penalty taken. He's a Brazilian. He should be able to take a penalty. His neck's wider than his head. <sighs> could be part of it. I don't know. Spoiled it. Ah, oh, that's the rival defeat. Okay, I'm not... I'm not, um... Garning favour with the fans, am I really, by losing the rival game? The European one's fine. The other game was acceptable. Yeah. Okay, I have questions. Like I said, I don't normally play this style of play, right? I'm doing a wide target man. I don't care if they're crap, right? I want to try a wide target man for a period of time. So that will do that in the transfer window, as well as strengthening other positions. Using this tactic, how do I just go more attacking without just... Totally changing the way we're playing. I want to try and make this work. And like I said, it's not something I normally do. So I need a bit of help with it. Um, okay, so. One win, one draw, two defeats. Okay, we, the, our only objective this season was to not get relegated. We are technically bottom of the league. Uh, <laughs> but we're playing Horsens. So, <laughs> oh God. Uh, but it's not it's not relegated here though, is it? Because then we go into the, then it splits. Um, second half of the stage. No, hang on. 
I'm having, I'm, going, I'm, having, I'm having a brain fart. Start getting right. There's preliminary phase. Yeah, why? In the drop down of the preliminary, I feel like it should show me the. Okay. Um, I got it. Yeah, so there's the championship group and relegation group. So it's the bottom two are relegated. I love the fact that the top one gets to European places playoff. So you can be in the bottom half and get in Europe. Adds a bit of spice to it. So it's bottom two. Once we split. Okay, it's fine. Nothing to panic about. But if, yeah, feel free to leave me tips. Um, how to be more attacking but playing the same way without currently, without having any sort of target man. I think is the main problem. If I had a big target man up top, I could go, okay, we're just going to pin ball off him, have runners. Long, fast, counter-attacking, longish ball without any target men attacking. Go. Right, <laughs> thank you very much for watching. Not a spectacular... I think there's enough there to give me hope. I That was probably our best game, ironically, because we created a bunch of chances. Uh, but we'll see how the next couple go. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.